So how's your experience exploring the Metro Manila or the Philippines? I think everyone would probably agree to this, but other than the horrific traffic yeah. you guys have here, it really is a, a pain. Hello mga bevs, my name is Nico. And I'm FK. And welcome to Pep Spotlight. I know our Pepsers are very excited to welcome our guests for this episode. So we have the new lead stars of View's new show, Secret Ingredients. Secret Ingredients. Yeah. Okay, so before we proceed to our official Q&A, let's just first do a quick icebreaker so that yes. we get to... Yes. Yeah, have a feel of each other, okay? The secret ingredient to a successful career is just short one. Being able to face failure. Yeah. Um, two things, authenticity and humility. You have to be humble. The secret ingredient to a good life is... Contentment. Consistency. Consistency. Mm -hmm. And last, Finally, the secret ingredient to making love last is... Loyalty. Honesty. And that's it for our icebreaker, icebreaker challenge. Nice! Yeah. nice so you survived? <laughs> yeah. Okay, it's nice. And now we proceed to our official q &A. Q &A. We can start. Okay, so first of all, what was your initial reaction when you were um, given the script and you found out you're going to work on this series? It was a bit, uh, in, a, in a friendly sense, unexpected because obviously I never thought of myself as a cooking or chef image. So when I heard about this, I was like, oh, that's interesting. I, that's something I learned differently, how people can view me other than the, the previous images I had. So I was, yeah, I was kind of surprised, but very welcoming, basically. Mm -hmm. How about you, the other people? Yeah. I would have to agree with the unexpected, but the unexpected opportunities always turn out to be the, the most best, yeah. memorable ones. So I think, but more than anything, I was just really excited. I think um, for the whole day, if we're going to be asked this question, I think if there's one word, it's just the excitement was it was really there from from pitching from the very beginning so oh so was it did it add pressure since view philippines teamed up with unilever for this project and one this is one of their biggest for the year so i think it was the good kind of pressure more than anything i think it inspired me and motivated me to to make sure that the the goal was sana magawa namin to ng, ng, ng maganda because for me for view and Unilever to team up and then to trust the three of us to to tell this story. Malaki siyang bagay, malaki siyang opportunity. And then not only that, because I feel like yung cuisine natin, masya showcase siya sa show na to. And then imagine that we get to represent our country in this series. Parang it's such a it's such a huge honor for me. And um, again, it was such an inspiring opportunity na. Every day, every shoot day, I just I had that that drive and, and, and that motivation. Uh, yes, you no. know, I really I really want to be able to um, give my hundred percent and um, uh, committed myself fully to to this series because gusto ko siyang, syempre gusto ko siyang maging maganda at maging masaya yung mga Filipino viewers natin. And then on top of that, we have our global um, audience na reach in Korea and even Indonesia it's such a great opportunity for for everybody that is that is part of this this series so again I think my only feelings is just excitement and gravity and gratitude mm. I'm so grateful to be part of this so perfect, perfect. anything to add oh yeah go on um, not much of a pressure really honestly speaking because it doesn't matter which platform or what company or what production you're working for, or whatever collaboration it is. It's it's like it is work at the end of the day. It is what you do best. It is what you like to do, love to do. So I think we just kind of treat it as equal. Whatever production is, we give it our best. We work hard basically, and um, 
And it's also, uh, it's only, I'm going to quote this where, you know the phrase where it's a problem when you see it as a problem. So it's, it's a problem once you see it as a problem, right? So it's the same thing as once you put pressure on it, there will be pressure. But if you don't think of it as a pressure moment, then there is no pressure, is there? So. Mm, okay, so a lot of it has to do with your mindset. So can you tell us about your rules? Um, so Hajru is just a simple boy. Not a simple boy. <laughs> <laughs> a simple oh, boy. we're not supposed to tell yeah, that yeah. yet! Sorry. A, si a simple boy <laughs> okay, who, sorry. who got himself into um, cooking and tries to find <laughs> so hard to love <laughs> and forgiveness towards his life. And he finds that unexpectedly throughout his adventure with a bike escaping whatever he's, he was trying to escape from. It's a lot of meanings behind that, isn't it? I know, it's so hard. I, I just realized that it's so hard for him to explain his character <clears throat> because he, it, it, he may spoil the... Something. Yeah, I'll just, you know, I'll just give like a little, uh, yeah, just personality wise. He's, uh, he's confident. He... He's true to himself. He um, tries not to hide his emotions, and he's passionate with his loved ones. Yeah. It could be family, it could be partners, it could be anyone. Yeah. How about your character, Julia? Maya is um, a common chef who works at a hotel in Jakarta, Indonesia. Um, yeah, pretty much. Yes. I mean, yeah, <laughs> that's, being very careful. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much it. And then you see her her journey and her her goals when when you watch the series, what she's she's trying to make of, you know, herself and the problems that she's trying to to solve for for herself. And then, of course, in the midst of all of that, she you know finds inspiration in in the kitchen, which comes unexpectedly for her as well. In what ways were you guys able to relate to your characters? The passion towards love, like, I can relate to that because I think everyone can relate to that, really. It's not something just my character or just me, but uh, when it comes to love, people can be very passionate, emotional, um, sensitive with that sort of topic. Um, but I think also maybe something specific, I would say... You're also a simple boy, Chad. Are you, or, <laughs> or is that something really? different from you and your character? Yeah, we both kind of want simple things. Okay. Yeah. Um, Maya and Julia. Uh, I think her being passionate and her being driven. So since the series is all about cooking, uh, if you could describe each other as a flavor, what would it be? And why? And why? Sweet. A flavor. Sweet and spicy. Sweet and Sweet spicy. And spicy. Oh, I was yeah. thinking of um, that as well. Mm. Sweet and spicy. Sweet, Sweet and spicy yeah. for both of you. Okay, well, on that note, we just want to know, do you guys, are you guys also good in the kitchen? Like, do you guys cook? I think he's better at the kitchen than <laughs> Really, honestly. So really? And, and yeah. Because I've seen some of your vlogs, he also cooks. Yeah, I, so I cook, but I think he's a much better He's cook. better. Okay. It's, just, it's just fun to be able to play around with the ingredients and and later on you taste it, you, you get that satisfaction. <laughs> and he's like a master chopper now. <laughs> oh, like he's really <laughs> good at it. <laughs> okay. so, I'm not like chef level, but I, I'm, I'm not, not confident. I'm not confident yet. Last few questions, yeah. going back onto your characters. Uh, since you played a lot uh, of different roles before, what are the new things we can see with Julia this time around? Well, parang I feel so blessed because I've been given opportunities lately to really learn new things. So I love that, you know, with the movie that's showing now, I had to learn how to sing. And then for this one, I had to learn how to cook. And I always love that I get to challenge myself in that way. So with this one, you know, of course, it's, it's more than cooking that I had to do. It's the technicalities, it's the preparation, it's the fabricating, it's the, it's all of those things. And um, I think being in a global project as this and then being able to work with like 
LSH and Nicholas and our director and, and Karina and everybody who's part of the show, I think there is a lot of firsts for me. But yeah, I mean, being in the kitchen and, and, and being a chef, I think that's the first time I'm playing a chef, so. For LSH, you've been exploring around. So what, <laughs> yeah. how's your experience? We're seeing- Spotted a, everywhere. <laughs> spotted everywhere. <laughs> So how's your experience exploring the Metro Manila or the Philippines? Um, it's been great, really. Um, other than the, I think everyone would probably agree to this, but other than the horrific traffic yeah. you guys have here, it really is a, a pain when it comes to traveling in Manila. But I realize it really does cover up a lot of, um, a lot of that big um, negativity because of food and the companionship and the, the people here like they're very friendly like I didn't feel like I was in a such a foreign country because everyone is there to kind of help you out there. everyone mm. kind of gives you that helping hand mm. so I felt that that was great and um, yeah that's fun I really have fun it's going around Good food always makes up for all the negative things <laughs> in a place. Tell me about it. Yeah. We call this uh, Ako Yon or Hindi Ako Yon. If the description fits you, you say yes. Yeah. So <laughs> you say a say thumbs like, up yeah. or if the description doesn't fit you, you say Do yes. this. Yeah. Okay. So we're just going to say a few statements or quick phrases. Simple. Okay. Yeah. Let's do this. First one, burn rice while cooking. I think I did Burnt once. Rice? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have you? No, I don't remember. Internet skills, Julia. Yeah. Margali magsaing si Julia. I think I, I think I burnt rice before when I was I was a I was a boy scout. Oh, okay. we a boy scout. I was cooking oh. I was cooking rice the first time. I burnt it and I was like, oh, so this is not clearly not how you do it. So. At least you learned. Yeah, and no one can blame me for that. It's very manual. Yeah, basically. <laughs> okay, the second one, a sleepy head. Is that you or is that not you? Are you a sleepy head? Sleep well, today, yes. <laughs> but on a normal basis. I think I'm always sleepy. Yeah. Always I can sleep. relate. Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Learns all their lines in an instant. I don't want that to come from me. <laughs> I, mean, like, I can't be the judge of myself, so. Do you guys find it hard or is it easy for you? But, um, how, how long does it take? I don't know, it doesn't sound so humble if we answer this question. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, maybe we can move on. It. <laughs> How about you answer, you answer for each other? I think you did great. Oh, oh. thank you. Oh. That's I think great. Okay, next one. Loves eating while on set. <laughs> yes, we can see your IG stories. <laughs> 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 they see all the food. All the food. I love food. I wouldn't say. I think I love to work in a, with a light stomach. I think when I was younger, I was more like, ah. Like I, I need all the food to, to fuel up, but now I think I uh, just enough just enough for for um, energy for that day. What? I think it really depends on what country I'm in. As well. I'm in as well. Like, so you're in the new countries so yeah, you're like out to try out every everything. Every food out here is, tastes so good as well. So that's why <laughs> it's, it's hard kinda, for it's not to. Like, yeah, I'm like, oh, and then Philippine people love to feed you. Yes. I realize that. So it's the love language. Yeah. So yeah, I like to work on a light stomach. Loves spicy food. Yes. I'm not great with spicy food, but I do love it. It has a lot of good flavors in it. So. Whoa. Okay, lastly, um, experienced an embarrassing moment while filming on set. Hmm. I probably have. I just can't recall, probably, but I probably have. I did as well, yeah. I think, oh. yeah, oh, yeah, definitely did. Okay, thank you so much. much. Please invite our invite. viewers to watch Secret, Secret Ingredient. Ingredient. So, hi everyone, make sure to watch Secret Ingredient only on view. Is that what you guys want it? <laughs> <laughs> and also, don't forget to follow our socials. View Philippines at Peppler's also. Thank you, guys. Thanks, guys. Thank you, Thank you, so, you much. so much. Thank you.